It's a working man I am And I've been down underground And I swear to God If I ever see the sun Or for any length of time I can hold it in my mind I never again will go down underground At the age of 16 years With my father close to as he vowed never again to send his sons To the dark recess of the mines Where you age before your time And the coal dust lies heavy on your lungs It's a working man I am And I've been down underground And I swear to God If I ever see the sun Or for any length of time I can hold it in in Nottingham are still very similar like that, they're in rows, you know. Right, right. When you went down, you put your token in and you had to make sure you came back with the right token the, so they knew who was down there. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Before the lamps are red by candlelight. Wow. But gas, I think, was the big yes. <laughs> the rules. Squash up and watch you for me closing the kit. Or you believe in super force of the hand. Most cool, laddie. Did you see what it would have been like? Yes, right. Yes, right. Right. That's what keeps you up when you're doing it. Come on, Tommy. Take that reaction. Hey, we are. were nowhere near like Yeah, today. yeah. But, the rat. But, <laughs> yes. 
And the cat. Yes, and the cat. The cat and the rat. You can go that way if you want. Thanks. Thanks. <laughs> That's just dying we'll push it, to. We'll push it through. <laughs> <laughs> You've only got a day ticket, it might take you a week to get you out. <laughs> I'd be there for good. <laughs> That's the face of the, the mind. It's our fear. So, stand back. <laughs> Yeah, that's a drill hey, holes what here what to put the uh, stop asking man and watch. Just two foot drill bit. No. Where did the brace and between the floor and the roof? Well come on. That drill gun to the logo. That's right. No, just go to handle, not the gun. Okay. <laughs> You're not going to take this photo, are you? No, I didn't, did I? <laughs> <laughs> well, then he was little, she kept coming round and slapping his bottom. I did she? You can see everybody's been doing the same. <laughs> <laughs> you might as well take his photo. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> <laughs> You feel like a back after all that, wouldn't you? Very, very close communities. Yeah, yeah. Um, because there was a, well, a lot of deaths. Yes. And they would have got each other through it. They would have helped one another. Yeah. Wow. You have to open the door. Yeah, can you open the door and see what's in there? Oh, I've run out of newspaper. Fetch the Harold. <laughs> Does he say the same thing each time? Wait yet, Tone. I'm going to be in here for a while. Must be the white shop pies. <laughs> <laughs> I beg your pardon. <laughs> so you did your washing, wasn't it, in the old days of Boston? And can you... Are these your picnic band? Yeah, uh -huh. you, better, you have a very big um, one in Durham every year. Mm. You know, they have to put the queen of the... Okay. <laughs>
<laughs> Which one are you? I think I'm still here. All right. I haven't left. <laughs> All the comments on this. Okay. Well, uh, hey. So we didn't win. <laughs> <laughs> Down the pit. You do the commercial for this. Here she is now. I find it in Alfie great disease here. Just as well with that, will It is cheap, full of proteins, and what's more, they help you to face up to the day. To, to face up to a pine needle. Oh, yes, there's a lot more wood in eggs than people realise. <laughs> Well, the miners' strike in uh, Ben. It's terrible, you know, because the police were brought in and they haven't them literally, you know, reading. Uh, yeah. That there yeah. is the colliery where these yeah. two colours are employed at. Uh -huh. And that there is the colliery rope where it stops, uh -huh. which is just a mere 200 yards away from them yeah. and from the colliery itself. So, I mean. A very small radius of activity. Yeah, exactly that. Yeah. So, at a glance, lovely people, uh, you know, they're having a lovely time. If you stare at it for a little while longer, you start to see a very narrow world yes. for these mm -hmm. two. And it's. Uh, Experiencing them. Yeah. Uh, Right. The rise and rise, not the the and the 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 and the 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 And everyone crowd and shout them, oh, who is it and what's happened? They bring you out of the heapstead head first if you're dead mm. or feet first if you're injured. Mm. So then everyone can have a, a, a glance and see who it is and what happened. And oh it's gosh. a sort of respectful way mm. of doing it, you know, rather than just, you know, letting everybody shout who is it. Anyway. So yeah, so that's happened. Um, and Arthur Wynnum, obviously, very, very intelligent man who he was, recognised that this, all this death, he's surrounded by death and, and yes. injuries all the time, it never, never stops. I mean, but uh, what's the average? It was one death a week in a fifth or something like that. People always yeah. died, you were always getting into it. Um, it was a religion around here, football was yes. a religion. And um, a lot, of, there was actually a saying that if a, a football team or a football manager needed a new player for their team, he visits a colliery oh, and he yeah. shouts down the pit and a new footballer, a new striker would emerge. So yeah. to speak, yeah, all your best players from those times were Pitman. Yeah. They came from Pit villages. They they were the, the best football players, really. You know. Like